<clears throat> Greetings. I'm waiting for you to tell me your past and explain the strange verge uh, of that cultist on footfall. Yes, I'm ready. I would ask only one thing of you, rogue trader. If I may, I would like to see the chamber of the sacred warrant and kneel before the relic touched by the Emperor himself. A difficult conversation lies ahead of us, and I wish to pray by the relic before I lay my soul bare. That's not a simple thing to ask, but sure, why not? Because because she has actually respects the blood of the emperor, which is actually pretty hardcore stuff. Ei toi paha 2005, 2006, oli puolitoista viikkoa alle 30 takas. Minus 30, 30. Ouch. Joulu ja uuden vuoden aikaa. On se, on se kyllä kova. Argenta drops to her knees, her hands making a sign of Aquila. Two headed eagle sickle that signifies it. I think it's something like this. Her eyes are locked in the sweeping signature of the Varant. Seemingly mundane thing merely flourishes on a piece of paper unless one knows who hand left that mark and whose blood is on the paper. If thou seest flaw in me, smite me. If thou knowest fall in me, burn me. With the flames furry and righteousness, but thou seest the light in me, grace me. If thou hearest the display of me, bless me. With the wrath of fury and forgiveness. Righteousness. Argen's voice is sonorous and if made for the singing hymns and prayers, but right now she cannot seem to catch her breath. So overwhelmed with emotion is she. For I breathe the will of thine. For I will leave the law of thine. Carry thy word, O Emperor. I bring solace to servants of thine and ruin the voice of thine. A fight of terror and righteousness. Ryhtönässäkin jäätä vesiputket, vaikka sinne lä lämmityskaapeli. Joo. Se nyt silleen voi käydä. Rock Territor, we need to talk. Or rather, I need to tell you something. The truth, the truth about I ended the road of one Valencian ship and about the cultist we encountered on footfall. I'm listening. Please understand, I couldn't trust you before. I tell you my story and you see why. I'll start at the beginning. It's easier to piece everything together that way. Upon arriving the expanse and on footfall, I found no purpose here, only torment. I wasn't needed. The relic I had been assigned to safeguard was already well protected by the by Reverend Hirnamus mission. And no one was even trying to defile it. For our lawlessness, footfall respects the worship of the Emperor. That is, that was when Lady Theodora, head of your dynasty, appeared. She became an a agent of divine will, in a way. It was from her that I learned the planet recently discovered by her, her scouts, Salis Prime. For a rogue trader, the planet was little of little interest, a federal world away from the convenient warp roots. But for me, for me learning about its existence was a revelation. Does it belong to the Wong Valencius dynasty? Yes, the planet is yours by right. But not as simple as that, the warp root leading to it was lost. I will explain to them. May I continue? The description of Celis plan was familiar to me. It seemed to very similar to the world of former ancient legend. Legend of Saint Argenta and her ship. Argenta the living saint, she's my patroness, the order named me after her. She, she, she died millennia ago when heretics caused her ship to fall from the skies. But even those blasphemers could not touch Argenta ashes or her holy relic, the one star. For the fallen ship which now served as the resting place for the saints remains. Oh, 
would only allow the truly righteous to enter. All others would meet their death. I imagine, imagine when I, what I felt this flash of insight upon me. The world where Saint Argenta ship fell was merely a vague legend. No one knew its actual whereabouts. And suddenly I, myself, named after Saint, came, came across this information. I realized at that moment that it was potent, that I must journey to the planet and find the ship. So I asked Revenant here must to let me go for a time on a personal pilgrimage. I boarded Theodora's ship and demanded passage to newly discarded planet Salis Prime. Where did you keep your super season from Revenant Hiramus? Uh, you mentioned something called One Star, what is it? Defeat. Ship August fought the death of anything or not during orbital scanning. I was expecting this though, according to the legend ship can conceal itself for naked eye. I only pilgrim procured it by pure hurt, can't find it. What I didn't expect was an ambush allowing us on the planet. I landed there with the sp all in provided Theodora. I know Saint Argenta hagiography by heart, know all the legends about her. I followed the obscure clues, the descriptions of mountains and rivers of millennial tales. And I was certain that I had found the way to the ship. That's when we were attacked. The words we heard heretics shrine on footfall, something about waste doors please addressed some lord. It's a daybreak. But they were the same words as spoken by the cultists who attacked us in the Salis Prime. My whole unit perished. All those honest brave people I le had led to search for the relic it was only a miracle that I didn't perish along with them. I didn't connect these events at first. The cultists on footfall to Coniston Salis Prime. The cultists attacking the ships and con Conrad's betrayal. What if these all links in, in the same chain? What if they, they have long since infiltrated ranks of the Valen Wound Valencia servants? What if I let those heretics to the sacred planet on my search? So, how did you manage to escape from the cultists? The other people received the distress call, came to my rescue and brought me aboard this ship. I barely remember what happened. When they arrived, I was already severely wounded, watching back with whatever remained of my strength. I think I shouted that we had to go after them, but they didn't listen. They took me to the shadow and pulled out. After that, that's all blackness. When I came to, we were already in the middle of warp jump. Theodora had urgent matters to take care of, and she decided that she could clear out the planet at a later time. Sadly, only one who no might not all our sons Kundrat escaped. Oh yes, I sincerely hope that we will meet him again, that Serpent needs to answer a few questions before he is plunged into cleansing flame. That's why you didn't trust me before. Yes, Rogue Trader. I saw my own eyes how a member of family showed his two colors, colors as a servant of the arch enemy. I had already suffer, suffered humiliating defeat at, at the hands of cultists and was afraid of another betrayal. Couldn't be forthright with you, so I studied you, looking at seeds of corruption and light, order light of righteousness. Okay. And what did you find? A man who stood shoulder to shoulder with me helped eradicate the cultist on fought for. Although my opinion of you started to change even before then, but when you talk, agreed to talk with all friends at my request. Ah! A leader who's willing to honor those who light down their lives for them and take care of their children is a leader in who inspires trust. And the way you acted uh, in that moment. Do you remember? Remember, there was a young man you, whose griefs and a column fusion had driven him to insolence. You found a word that could comfort him. You didn't punish him, didn't scare him with a show of austerity. 
You even admitted that you were not all powerful surprised me. I even saw it as weakness at first, but after giving some thought I saw the wisdom in, me, in it. The way you openly addressed the thoughts, thoughtless boy does, does you credit grow trader. So just to clarify you were wounded and you never found Sergeant Argenta's ship is that right? Ah, um, the situation where Argenta is pointing now is uh, is uh, what happened when I played this full version of the game. I think I handled the situation slightly different in a beta version. Yes, I rushed the third order and one of it I could walk in again. I insisted going back to Salis Prime to defend Relic from the heretics, but I was told that Warp had destroyed the old route to the planet and plotting a new one would take a great deal of time and effort. As if there could be anything more important than protecting the fate and hunting than the shamans of Ark enemy. In any way, in any event, the road was lost, all the knowledge of it died in the attack on the ship along with the old navigator. But now we have a new lead, data that we collected uh, in the coldest shrine of footfall. I don't care what re report but it we executed said. There must be a way to track them down. Tell me, Rogue Trader, will you help me in this undertaking? Will you help me to find this great relic and return to the people, to it, to the people of Imperium? There's nothing I wouldn't do to reclaim sacred object for the pe uh, people of the Imperium. So be it, rogue trader, as I sh stand before the Varant in the embodiment of the Emperor's will marked by his own hand. I vow that I will not relent until the Holy Relic has been returned and the heretics punished. And the might of the light be with us both on this. I think you are finding an opportunity to talk at Trusty. Now it would be a good time to explain the reason of my return about your ship. I welcome the chance to assist the Inquisition with his inquiries, Van Kalox. Lord Captain, your enthusiasm is commendable. To business then, the cult of final dawn, the madmen preach the heretical doctrine about tensions of the corrupt expanse and instigate crimes against Throno and humanities. One such crime took place in your protectorate. The Lord Inquisitor considered it necessary to have one of these acolytes and accompany the rogue trader in the, on the voyage in the corrupt region. I also me, need to meet with uh, one of my observers on the capital world of your domain. Why would Orno or Ordoxinos agents investigate chaos gold? You are very well versed in how the Inquisition is organized. So Inquisition is, is uh, made of dif different orders. This, we actually know about a lot of Inquisition because this book. So uh, Ordoxinos, Ordo Malis and Ordo Hereticus. So it would be like more about Ordo Hereticus and Malleus. Ma Malleus is a bit more like mutants, but yeah, all of them investigate the chaos cults as well. Yes, initially our arrival in the Kronos Expanse was dictated by the need of to fight Xenos, but there's more. The cult is tangentially re related to my mind specialization. Perhaps I will be able to reveal the full to root someday, but right now I ask you to display humility and patience. Nordic has mentioned this in letter that he is willing to show lenience towards my actions. That would otherwise be interpreted as radical. That is correct. I should show greater tolerance for the mistakes of a newly appointed rogue trader. To be frank, I'm surprised the Lord Inquisitor is not the type to indulge the weakness of soul and mind, even if uh, even if somebody who only recently accepted the burden of the lot lofty title. I 
I want to know more about this cult of final dawn. And wrong pattern. There's the world of Kiavakama. <laughs> Imagination chaos uh, usually go beyond the solidly inflicting countless death and destruction. One of the systems in the Chronos expanse is already lost, may the Emperor protect us. We met a Chaos Space Marine on Rugat Minoris. Do we risk running into his brothers? That's a good question. I have no doubt it will happen sooner or later. Oh no. Chaos Marine sailing with the cult is very, very bad news. Most likely they kept away until recently, pulling their puppet strings from the respectable distance. Three traders seldom show up alone. The best we have count on having to deal with just the squad of scale space marines on the Chronos Expanse. <laughs> and not the entire company. Oh no. Oh no. Tell me about... Um, why did it your suspicion fall on Kiavakama? Disjointed pieces of data. I listened long, not long ago a vessel won world award. The football reports from the crew were confused and alarming, making me fear planet wide rebellion. Again. I want anyone to throw their weight around on my worlds, be they servants of Chaos or heretics. A commendable aspiration. Tell me about Drukhari, who stole the Rukach son. The Drukhari, from the princess of Eldari. Ancient and vicious Xenos race. So basically dark elves. These creatures are living terror to ordinary people who prey on to their raids for the simple reason that the victims are not killed outright but instead becoming their belatings. Uh, just as you and I Need air to survive through career require psychic energy born from the torment and pain. Which they extract from the captives with uncanny expertise. Yeah, they are fun bunch. Their ships, which are difficult to mistake for any other, arrive suddenly and are detected. Their stealth technology greatly surpasses the capabilities of standard Imperium Augur arrays. The objectives of their race is never to capture a world of ship, no, they are only interested in first victims. After filling their holds with the living captives, they disappear in the web bay, a different di dimension which conceals the greatest stronghold, Gomorra, the dark city of the Drukhari, from which, which none can hope to escape. I do not know what Drukhari stole Rukat's son, brought the fulfillment of God's prophecies. Perhaps the Xenos themselves have played in the Archimedes designs, or perhaps Aurora's divinations. In fact, describe the Drukhari actions. There's one little, one little thing I can say about with absolute certainty. There's no alliance between the Cult of Final Dawn and Xenos. It is simply impossible. Okay, interesting. My goal is not to hinder you. Hmm. Interesting, some exposition here. Kiavakama. Lucrative opportunity. Ah, we have a J, J with us.
complete the development project and establish a new colony strike a deal with the influential partner. Classified information. Allow me to thank you again for helping me with the cargo, Sherin. I am sure the Ashmags who squirreled away my goods won't give up so easily, and I'll hear more about their scheming yet. Let's strike a deal, Sherin. I will watch your back if you do me a favor and watch mine. <laughs> well, enough jokes. Is there something you wanted? Oh, Sherin, I did manage to spark your interest. Allow me to invite you to a more private place. My words are meant for your ears alone. Okay. Let's start smuggling or something. Sure, an exalted one himself brought us together the day you crossed the Vladim threshold. He led us a cargo and gave his blessing for his return. Do you know what people in my world say when there some such thing happens? What's gained to, is, to be shared with your neighbor? I'm sharing what, what I have gained with you. Please I accept this humble gifts in honor of what is successful to suddenly struck friendship. Elder, elder weapon. Okay. True. Okay, true Harry weapon and elder weapon. Truly wonderful gift. I accept it with gratitude. I knew you would appreciate Xenos mastery on their craft. Yeah, I, I think they have, well, pretty, pretty, well, not, not much dead, not much deadlier weapons than Imperium uses, but much more useful. Um, Imperium has like low tech weapons. So the matter I wanted to discuss with you is related to my business. You know that I sell like, Xeno artifacts to interested Imperial subjects. An Imperial trinket to Xenos. Business is going well, my metric runs even without my precipitation. But when it comes to expansion, well, that's where I hit the wall. Rivals, and where's my success? Falco, especially. I'm certain that Tift of the Cargo was his doing. While the Imperium Authority might be fragmented in the expanse, I, it could crack down on people, my profession at any time. Go on. The rogue trader could put a good word on, for me with the servants of the Adeptus administration. It became an official trade response of the Imperium. Uh, just imagine it, little scrap of paper offer me my, and my agents protection against asthma regimes. Far better than any fair factor field. And even in physicians we have to think twice before they may mess with me because I'll be a representative of the law on my own right. Cost you precisely nothing. So I, th I think I'm going to be like, yeah, I'm a rogue trader. I have a, I have power for this. How do I benefit for your gaining official status? 
besides re receive my eternal gratitude. Would it be, it be beneficial to have someone in your retune, the weight of the authority behind them? My agents will be your eyes and ears throughout the expanse. Sounds simple enough, I will help you. Exalted one, bless you, Shireen. I couldn't find a better business partner in all the expanse. Friends, this a gift from the Exalted one, and we must cherish it. And you will have no complaints about your f or friendship. You must have some faction in mind that would you you would like to establish relationship. Caspaliga might might be. Petrusians. I made some some progress with the with the Caspaliga. No, I I made made a friends with the pirates. So Caspaliga and Petrusians both are. I think I'm going to take the Drusians. Faction report received. I will humbly wait your st to steer your tra vessel to Dragonus. The Mercatum Tabula officially. Sounds as majestic as front of them. Okay. <laughs> warp warp uh, travel isn't. Green roads are absolute safest. The yellow roads are signal the unpredictable events that can occur during the jump. Nice. Orange roads denote the high probability of ship coming under attack even in warp. Red roads are so sign typically assaulted by hostile force during travel. Navigators inside. That can be acquired. Standard scanning could not reveal the route to, to the selected system, but you can still get there by spending points in Navitagator inside. Uncharted system. Cauldron. Haunting birds. Cartember scourge. Unbeholden reaches. I like how, how it's actually a uh, Sinner's Maledictum Cursed Demestine Heathen Stars Intersquare's Realm So I wonder where is, is our planet Planet is here Chronos Expanse the system but we don't have a route there so we have a safe route not so safe route dangerous route and very very dangerous route to the Imperium okay Wow, 
pirates. Yeah, sure. Come, come into my. <laughs> okay, I can actually shoot, shoot both of these. Supreme. We don't have a supreme commander. Okay. Fire at will. Helmsman, take us in. Make every shot count. Engage the engines. Macro cannons, open fire. Okay, maybe they have a dead fish. They, they are trying to disengage. Helmsman, take us in. Coordinate set. Available. With the force of a supernova. Macro cannons, open fire. Navigate this inside. Build more, okay. Okay, that's a Janus over there. Let's. Sector 3 to address that my spirit of ship have been preferred.
inextricably mischief spirits is capable of many unpredictable calculations and actions. So we managed to get here. But apparently it wasn't wasn't that safe. Small human dwelling. It's called Hermita Blessing. Uh, old Hermit turned it to the navigator. He had retreated this planet long ago. So, Adamantine, not much. Space Hulk. Drifting Voidship. Okay, we are entering the Space Hulk. Nice. Yeah, one, one of the first Warhammer games was Space Crusade, which which actually set, set it was set in the in the Space Hulks that are coming from the warp warp. Always keep your eye on the prize. And computing gathered thrill. Shield a soul machine gun from the evil that has a can hold of your temple. Save us, preserve us from corruption, so us the way. Sacred metal that bars the path is weakened. Let us appeal to the machine spirit of one of the generators so the metal might drink its blessed energies. What is this evil? This ship is sick. My options open. Mad tech priest. Oh, this is this is fun place. Oh, Messiah, grant me the wisdom to receive. Some kind of event horizon type of rise to the top ship left in the dust. that has been in hell, which is exactly the place they are using for travel. So, okay, so maybe Keller fields of this ship failed. Just flesh you betray me. I'm drowning in my of flesh and sinew. But my spirit longs for the perfection of the machine. We will mend you. Okay. He has mutations. We will mend you. Well, that's one way. The Emperor sets my path. Onward. We 
system pressure value two. Invalid value. Expected value of ten. Plus one, plus five. I woke up with a feeling of wonder, as if a field of flowers was blossoming nearby. A child was saved from death. A thousand heritage. You are authorized. Glad that worked out. So I shouldn't get like wounds for whole whole group. Uh, interesting. I have a nose for profit and a taste for adventure. I've seen a lot of innocent people. I have yet to see someone remain so after an interrogation. The Emperor sets my path. Ready as always. Oh, don't you trust me? Ready, protected in boots. What advice do you seek? You will beg for mercy, but I will grant none. <laughs> Let's try this again. As the Emperor commands, I act. This is why I was chosen. I'll do it. Uh, couldn't, couldn't. Doubt is for the weak. Hit the broad side of barn, basically. For the throne's glory. Let's see to it. We kind of get uh, need a uh, very good ro roles for the servitors. So that's that's kind of the issue here. Although we could pepper them with the plasma. Indeed. Yeah, good good damage here. It will be done. Target well struck. But I have a problem that when when I get him him down, there's some kind of something else coming. Ouch! Is a reward. Okay, that's a good, 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 good. Can see As only this. Commands, I, act. I missed. Power resides in the will of the righteous. Mm. 
I'll do it. Very heroic, actually. Oh uh, no. As the Emperor commands, I act. Okay, she guess she can come down here. I will bathe this battlefield in righteous fury. Tell me, and it is done. But this Eldar weapon is doing very good damage against servitors. Who would have known? Let's make some opportunities. This defense is a good offer. Artists just it will be done. coming in at just in a nick of time. Indeed. Yeah, that hammer is is is, is crazy. Uh, yeah, yeah, right. Stands against me. Naturally. your beck and call. Big An exemplary strike. It will be done. I'm I'm not doing anything to that loudspeaker for some odd reason. We gone. Everyone, step aside. Let's see to it. Brace yourself, Avalard. Follow my lead.
Hello. Target well struck. Indeed. So we need to get these do down as fast as possible. The problem with this is that this mechanic is that if you don't get them down in a first turn and it's all about dice rolling, you are not going to it's it's going to be an uphill better from there. As the Emperor commands, I act. Wanna see a trick? So now, now we got the root buff, and now we are doing hitting his hit points. So the loud loudspeakers are doing pretty, pretty worse. Pretty much making our job and life much harder here. That, that, we should destroy that and that. Too bad I never leave that on pain. Repair for the protocols. Yes, crap. Yeah, this this buffs feels pretty o OP. Well, it's a warp, so it's it's supposed to be OP, but it's still like feeling la rather hard or e even impossible. This game. Doubt is for the weak. First time I used this. Okay, that that worked pretty well. Basically, these are gathering a huge pile of hit points, which means that if you start to destroy them, I don't think you can. Okay, that this is possible. 
Yeah, that that make well. I'll make it sense. I refuse. Hello. You've got a prize. I've got a prize. The Emperor favors me today. I wonder if we can get to the Sanctum from here. Is there a power? Okay. Main computing catastrophe. Okay, there's some from the rage to what the beast iron protect us. Temptations flesh silica cleans us. So is this dark mechanicus or this mechanicus that are homicide save us? Always keep your eye on the price. Make us deeper just mahala. There is Oh, in the room is printed we want mixture of miasma spot to mechanical and biological organ, blood, trust, vomit, machine oil. Why are disturbing piece of holy martyrs the home of grief? What do you want? The symbols your brethren protect themselves are symbols of chaos. Your knowledge is lacking how invader does a secret holy symbol imparted us by the omissaya. So get okay, it these are dark mechanicus. How else would protect comrades have survived if not for their protection? So many were devoured by evil. Coercion minus fifty. I have fifty percent. Clearly, what happened here? Succeeded. Struggling to say something. Okay. Warp, warp machine. War machine. Your arrogance will be your downfall. Okay. As the Emperor commands. <laughs> ah, that was counter attack. I won't go down easy. Okay, it's getting dam it's demonic machine, so it's, it's basically getting damage from the prayers. And if he stays, oh no. It's, it's down. Surprisingly easy. Well, con well, considering that we are like total mess at this point of the mission, that's only fair. The evil, that we are evil, incarnate evil, the corruption that watches us day and night. 
You punished the evil. You tried to warn him, but I was deaf. Chip, Kiavagama. It followed us from there. So this is from Kiavagama. The sheep and the planet the traitors among the brethren, tormenting sacred mechanism, the corruption into their systems. They turned that which is holy to unholy. And they say this new twisted machines on us, on their tech commerce. We managed to flee, but the monsters found its way on the ship. Okay, we fought. Got after one model after other. That's gone, but cuts away rotting flesh. But it flowed. It's in invisible influence, the corruption it exclude. It claim us one by one. The crew were merely humans of flesh and blood. They were so weak. They succumbed so easily. We could not sa save them from evil. So we gave the ship the darkness among the stars. But the darkness came to us to the last module. This, in this last module where we entered to make our last stand, then I sacrificed myself. I began to feel that I stopped against the corruption emanating from the machine. I succumbed. The corruption came for our souls. The corruption of Kiavagama, traitors. The fabricated cancer. It all started with him. He was the one who led this tent into a sacred goal. He was the one who doomed our brethren. He was the one who spawned the steel monster. This furnace of our planet. Rest in peace. Okay, he's dead. <laughs>